Okay guys, back again with another review and today I'm going to be reviewing The Watchers. It's a thriller, horror, suspense, mystery type film and this is directed, actually the directional debut of M. Night Shyamalan's daughter, Ishna Shyamalan, I believe. And I'm not too familiar with a lot of M. Night Shyamalan's work. He's very, you know, polarizing. I, I guess that's the word to describe him. Some people either love his films or they hate him or they're kind of in between. I think he has excellent ideas. They're just very poorly executed. I have not seen every single one of his films. Maybe I'll, one of these days I'll give all his films a watch and except uh, The Last Airbender. I don't need to watch that. But uh Again, might I add, but maybe I'll sometime in the future I'll rewatch his filmography and rate them from worst to best. But this is the directional, like I said, this is the directional debut of his daughter Ishna Night Samalan, starring Dakota Fanning, and she plays Mina Lucy. And there, now let me just say that there are excellent ideas in this film but just like her just like her old man i feel like the the premise the concept of this film is excellent it is just very poorly executed and i feel like there are a couple of questions that i still have and that i have still yet to receive an answer from and the code of andy's care of it character Mina she's a she's a artist and she lives in lives in Ireland she gets trapped in the woods where there's pretty much no escape the further she tries to escape the woods the closer the the, the trees uh, the trees you know come together I, I, I don't I don't know how to explain it but the the further she tries to escape the woods, the more it kind of closes in on who who's ever trapped in the woods, and they're practically prisoners now. And Mina, she meets these three three individuals who's been trapped there for a long while now. And there's this there's this bunker that they stay in, where they avoid these creatures called the Watchers, as the film is entitled and all they do is all they do is want to watch them and that's essentially it if you stay outside of the bunker at nighttime you will be killed and i do love the the cinematography and the score and, and the accent the acting is excellent i just feel like there are some this concept was like i said i and I'm going to say it many times over. Great on paper. However, poorly executed. There's this, even this subplot of Mina going out to clubs, uh, going out to bars and pretending to be someone else. We never got an answer to that. I, I think this film, overall, it had a lot of potential, but it was just... It, yeah, it 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 wasn't all that great. Uh, it wasn't terrible either, but I, I feel like it could have been better. Overall, I'd give this film three and a half stars. Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.